how to see the progress bar when copying huge files on an iPad. The common concern when copying huge files from a flash drive to an iPad is we don't know if the copy process was finished or not. So today, I will show you how you can see the iPad's copy progress circle. So let's get started. Of course, we would need to plug in the flash drive to the iPad using a dongle. I am using an iPad 7 and I will connect a 32GB flash drive and copy an entire folder with a total of about 2GB worth of video files. After plugging in the flash drive, let us open the files app and wait until the flash drive appears in the sidebar. Once the flash drive appears on the sidebar, click on its icon to show the contents on the right panel. Before we start copying the file, we need to open another Files app window and set the two windows in split view. To set things up, the window on the left shows the files on my flash drive while we will change the window to the right so that it will show my files and folders stored on my iPad. Now as you can see on the left window, let's say I want to copy an entire folder with 8 subfolders from the flash drive to the iPad. Right click on the folder and click copy. Then choose a location on your iPad where you want to store the copied files or folder. Afterwards, right click on an empty space and click paste. At this point, you will see the progress circle that will serve as an indicator to know whether or not the copy process has been completed. You will also notice that during the copy process, the folder being copied is faded. This copy process depends on the speed of your device. For an iPad 7, the one that I am using, it takes around 20 seconds to complete a 500 megabytes worth of file. Now once you are finished copying the files, you will need to properly eject the flash drive from the iPad. Unfortunately, there is no eject button in the files app. So once you are finished copying the files to the iPad, you will need to close any files app that are open before removing the flash drive. Again, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please click the like button and don't forget to subscribe to get notified of future contents. This has been Harold and I will see you on the next one.